Hey y'all, it's your girl and for sure I'm about to do the Thirsty Thursday reading, okay? So, Thirsty Thursday readings are who is thirsting over you, who is sending you thirst traps, who is desiring you, okay? That is the information that will come from this reading, okay? So, the intention is for everyone who comes across this reading to find some type of message within it, okay? So, take what messages resonate for you some of this information some of the you know what i'm saying what we get some of the descriptions may be all over the place and guess what it could be because this person that is thirsting over you you know what i'm saying is has a lot of different types of traits or this could be multiple people or this could not be <laughs> your message you know what i'm saying so again that's why i say take what resonates for you so who is thirsting over you? Who is thirsting over you? All right. Okay. One thing I got is um this individual could be a healer. This this individual could be going through some type of initiative initiation at this time they could be finding their um purpose in life this is the rattlesnake um their rattlesnake could be or a snake you know what i'm saying could be their um spirit animal or something like that you know what i'm saying also on the flip side of it, this snake for me also represents like um changes and transitions and things like that but you know what i'm saying Sometimes snakes get a negative uh, connotation to it as well. So, you know what I'm saying? It could be somebody is a little snaky, a little slithering um, that is thirsting over you, okay? And then we have this ladybug. This is someone who is abundant, okay? Maybe someone who is in good fortune or going after um, good fortune or, you know what I'm saying? Like presently feeling, you know, fortunate and abundant, and abundant in their life, okay? Someone who is... um getting good things or good things are happening with this um individual okay let's see who is thirsting elk we have stand tall i'm gonna stop right there this could be someone who is tall <laughs> you know what i'm saying just could be as simple as that someone who's tall um, but stand tall and maintain your dignity no matter what. So maybe someone who, um, you know, has dignity, maybe someone who stands their ground, someone who stands up for themselves, um, someone who demands respect is what I'm getting as well. Someone who deserves respect, um, also, but I'm getting also getting like someone who does not, um, does not change because of how others feel. This could be someone who, you know what I'm saying, just stands on stands on their own, stands on what they um believe in despite of what others think or despite of what others say. Um that that can be, you know, something that describes this individual, okay? Who is thirsting? over you manatee accept the situation as is rather than fighting to change it this could be somebody who um you are with or someone who you already connected with that is like you know what i'm saying that's your boo y'all together you know what i'm saying ain't no changing ain't no switching up y'all together <laughs> y'all together that's your person you know what i'm saying your person been thirsting on you um but this could be someone who is all about um acceptance as well okay so i also just kind of got complacent um, this could be someone that is, um, complacent with themselves or with, you know, the situation with y'all's connection, maybe with how, um, your connection is presently. Maybe someone who now also just got, who doesn't put in effort as well. Someone who is not, not fighting to change anything so you know what i'm saying this could be someone that you need to just accept that it is what it is with all right that is um kind of what i'm getting from that as well okay so tiger you're being called this could be a leader you're being called upon to provide leadership so trust that you're capable of doing so this individual could be a leader um this could be someone who 
maybe has recently stepped into a position of leadership is also what I'm getting as well. Um, but it's going to be someone that comes across as um, someone who is capable, someone who is powerful, maybe someone who is trusting. Um, also is um, what I'm getting from that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Someone who is trustworthy, someone who others feel like they can um, depend on is who is thirsting over you okay so let's see are we gonna take all these these things, three of them okay we have lotto with instinct this could be someone who goes um who trusts their instinct okay someone who trusts their instinct someone who goes after um what it is that they're what what it is that they want someone who trusts themselves okay um the brat with rebellion also this energy of like going against others like this is someone who does not like they don't necessarily care what other people are saying like with this elk energy here like they don't care what other people are saying like there's someone who is um willing to pave their own way you know what i'm saying or someone who's willing to um i'm also getting like um willing to like make waves in a situation or you know what i'm saying like your rebel trendsetter kind of energy is what i'm getting from this also we have lizzo with self-love maybe someone who's on a self-love journey someone who's focusing on self this could be someone who um plays an instrument or is you know what i'm saying into instruments or something like that um as well into instruments into music uh, you know what I'm saying? Into I was about to say the mind when I look back at this um this lotto card. This could be someone who is um like I want to say a heavy thinker is also what I'm getting from this as well. You know what I'm saying? Maybe someone who takes time out to like really think. You know what I'm saying? Maybe take take times out to like settle down get quiet quiet their mind and really you know in order to see um what direction they should go okay who's thirsting over the collective janelle monet with fluidity this could be someone who goes with the flow this also what i'm getting with this fluidity as well is someone who um Maybe it's fluid in terms of their sexuality, okay? Um, this could be someone who is um, bisexual or maybe someone who doesn't even um, put a term to it, you know? And they're just, they just go <laughs> with the flow is kind of what I'm just getting from that, okay? We have Janae Aiko, emotions. I'm getting someone who may be emotional or someone who is um, does well with expressing their emotions um, or does not hide their emotions. Someone who um, lets their emotions out and lets their emotions, you know what I'm saying, be known. Yes, share them. Um, it's kind of the energy that I'm getting from this, okay? So, ooh. Who is thirsting on the collective? Who is thirsting on the collective? All right, the moon. This could be something that is um hidden. This could be someone who um I also get like illusion energy from this, but just subconscious, um, just sub subconscious as well. I also get like psychic energy. Also, like this could be someone that's thirsting on you, but not even really. Why well, I got not even really realizing this? Maybe they're subconsciously, you know what I'm saying, thirsting over you. Then we have the Page of Swords here. This could be somebody that's like looking into you, someone who is researching you, someone who is studying you, someone who is watching you. This for some of y'all, this could be someone who is stalking you. This could be someone who has um new ideas, fresh ideas, or some some type of idea that they want to um 
share with you or some idea that some, you know, like a thought or something that they want to share with you is kind of what I'm getting as well. Um, the tower, we could, this could be someone who's having some type of, um, like tower moment in their life, some type of unexpected event in their life, maybe some type of event that is like, um, you know, setting them, I really just got setting them back, but some type of, some type of unexpected event that is like going on in their life, like maybe causing something to crumble or, you know what I'm saying? This could be just someone who was not who you were not expecting to be thirsting over you um or someone you know what i'm saying someone who you least someone who you would least expect is kind of um the energy that i'm getting from that as well okay who is thirsting over the collective all right we have the world card here okay this could be someone who is closing out a cycle um someone this card though also represents um travel as well this could be someone who um is traveling maybe someone who wants to travel with you maybe someone who wants to travel the world with you um you know what i'm saying as this happy go lucky couple here is you know what i'm saying kind of the energy that i'm getting maybe someone who you traveled with um before is also you know um what i'm getting as well then we have this um knight of cups here maybe someone who wants to come and present an offer to you maybe someone who wants to um take you out somewhere maybe someone who wants to be you know what i'm saying i'm just getting date chivalrous type of energy um uh, someone who wants to be romantic with you that's or who you have been <laughs> romantic with before is is kind of what i'm getting from that also okay so who is thirsting of the collecto okay we had this page of wands energy someone who is real enthusiastic is the first thing that i got from this card but um maybe someone who is like going after things or going after new venture or new idea or something that they um that they, you know what I'm saying, want, that they desire, you know what I'm saying? Or whatever, it, this, I'm just really getting this enthusiastic energy from this individual. So this is someone who comes across as very, like, highly motivated and enthusiastic when starting up, um, when starting up new things, okay, to be in this page energy. So... We're going to stop it right there, y'all. Uh, no, actually, no. I want to get, let me get like a few more from this, from the Jazzy Divinely Inspired Messages deck. Let's see who is thirsting over oh, the collective. Who is thirsting over the collective? We'll just get like three down the side. Who is thirsting over the collective? Okay, go with the flow, the wheel of fortune, okay? This is someone who goes with the flow. Like, you know what I'm saying? I, I got that with this fluidity card as well. Someone who goes with the flow. Someone who um may be in an energy of fortune with this fortune coming out again. You know what I'm saying? Also, okay, we'll get these that came out. We have the strength card, focus, conviction, determination. Maybe someone who is focused. Maybe someone who, you know what I'm saying, is determined to come towards you. You know what I'm saying? Someone who has some sort of, you know what I'm saying, conviction to come towards you, to, you know what I'm saying, stick by you, to want you, thirst after you, something like that, okay? Time to recharge the hangman. This could be someone who is in a state of recharging, in a period of resting, in a period of um coming into, I'm getting like coming into like enlightenment because I'm thinking of like the um traditional picture of the hangman as well. Um, Then time to meditate, temperance energy, okay? This could be, again, someone who meditates, someone who takes time to themselves to relax with this time to recharge and time to meditate. Like, yeah, and this temperance with this um earth angel energy, okay? So, yeah, this is just, I'm really just getting like um heavy energy here of uh, the 
the individual who is thirsting over you. There's someone who, you know what I'm saying, likes to relax. Maybe someone who likes to take their time. I'm getting leaders, someone who is focused, someone who is, you know what I'm saying, fortunate, someone who is um, also a healer but stands on what they believe in. We also have someone who wants to travel with you, someone who you are not expecting, someone who um, subconsciously wants you but trusts their instincts. Maybe they don't know why they're directed or guided towards you, but they are directed and guided towards you and want to go after with you. You know what I'm saying? With eagerness and enthusiasm. Enthusi <laughs> enthusiasm. Okay? So, that is who is thirsting over you. Y'all take care and have a jazzy day.